Hi, Craig here. Today I just want to talk about the four stages of combustion and just give a little bit of insight in how this works. So the four stages represent the delay, I've got it written up here, uh, flame prop propagation, direct combustion and post combustion. And I think this chart really explains what's going on there. So what we have to look at is what is the fuel delay? So injection is going to take place at a certain, certain time and we can look down here between 90 and 60 degrees, number one, injection. So injection starts here, and there's a delay period. And that's time for the fuel to get in, get mixed, turbulence will help mix that, and it's going to start to heat up. And in stage two, some of the molecules that have been mixed with the air and the, the atoms, atomized parts of the diesel, will start to burn. And when these small pieces start to burn, they will entice others around them to burn. And this process will start, you will start to see all these different uh, little atoms start to burn with all its atoms around it burning, and it's going to flash over. And when it flashes over, we call that direct combustion. So here's our delay period. We inject the fuel. It's being mixed. It's atomized. It's very small. Number two, they're burning, propagating. They're starting to burn until complete flashover will happen. And when complete flashover happens, it's called direct combustion. And that's up here at three. So direct combustion happens, it explodes very quickly, and then the power drops off. Now, the, the explosion is dropping off, so the energy is dropping off. And you can see between here and here, this is post-combustion. And fuel can be injected in there to continue the burn, to help reduce emissions and keep that power stroke strong. So these are the four stages. Now, originally we injected once at this point, and then propagation took place, and then flashover or direct combustion, and then the post burn. In new modern injection systems where we can inject three, sometimes eight times, in this area we can keep injecting fuel. At different times. So we can inject fuel here and then can, as a, as a pre-injection and then do it again here as another pre-injection to get the fire bigger. Uh, the propagation is happening. It's starting to burn. We could even inject one more there and by the time it reaches uh, direct combustion there could be a small more fuel injected and we have a, a large flashover. This control, or the shaping, rate shaping they call it, of the fuel is allowing the engines to be quieter, burn more effectively. On the post-combustion, we can add fuel in there to complete the burn. If there's an after-treatment system, we can add fuel in there to go into the after-treatment system. Complete control of this, the four stages of combustion. Keeping in mind, the delay period is a constant, and the fuel burns at a constant rate. So all, all these stages are important, and even so we have multiple injections at this time, we still can enhance each of those stages by starting a fire, putting more fuel into it, having a cleaner burn, less knock, less smoke, less emissions.